In transportation logistics, we're seeing a big trend towards being able to determine the context of assets as they're moving through the supply chain. Uh, I should be able to get whatever information I need to get in my moment of need. If I can know earlier in the process uh, what items I'm collecting, uh, what, what the dimensions of those goods are, I can downstream plan much better how many trailers I deploy to a distribution center, how many trucks I line up for delivery to an end location, um, and I can streamline my, my workflow and my operations as a result of collecting that information earlier. Something we call orchestrating the next best move. In North America alone, that less than truckload freight industry is about a $30 billion industry, and about 8% of that $30 billion is what's called revenue leakage because carriers don't have information about the dimensions of that freight, uh, and therefore they don't have integrity of dimension and weight information all the way back to the point of pickup. And so there's two and a half billion dollars just falling on the floor for these carriers. So if we can dimension the freight as it's being unloaded off vehicles in real time, then we can allow that revenue recovery to happen and that two and a half billion dollars to go right to the bottom line of the less than truckload uh, carrier companies. Another example where the Internet of Things can be leveraged to really have an impact on, you know, not just operations but on society in general is in the area of food transport. Uh, the United Nations estimates that about one-third of all food perishes in transport. It's just an unbelievable number and uh, you know, something we really just can't live with as a society. A lot of transportation logistics customers have been focused on optimizing the current state and the current operating procedures and workflow. Uh, with the Internet of Things and Enterprise Asset Intelligence unlocking new real-time information about the environment and their operations, uh, essentially democratizing data so everybody has access to it, and by leveraging location information together with sensor information about the temperature and state of those goods, be able to be proactive about the way it's managed through the supply chain, reduced waste, uh, decrease the cost of food, enable it to be able to get to more people uh, in a more timely fashion and in a better, more healthy state. We see the future of transportation logistics about orchestrating that next best move.